All right, this is a brief overview as to how I get internet for my uh, Xbox over the wireless without shelling out like a hundred bucks for an adapter. So as you can see right now, I'm downloading an update from Xbox Live. And in the back of the Xbox, you can see that blue ethernet cable. Hopefully you can see that there's the uh, blue ethernet cable. And that runs out the back up through that hole. And on the other side of the hole, there's the blue ethernet cable. It runs down there up and into the back of this router. Uh, as you can see, there's no internet input on this router and yet I'm still getting connection to download a uh, update. Uh, so how do I do it? Uh, the answer is simple. On my Linksys router I've installed a custom firmware, I believe it's called DD WRT, something like that, or maybe WRT DD. Um, but anyways, I install that and this has become a wireless bridge. So it's taking the wireless signal from the air and turning it into a hard wire for my Xbox. Now this also, this has four ports as you can see, so I can run my Xbox, a computer over here, um, a Wii, or whatever, or anything that has internet capabilities without a internet adapter. So um, that is how I do it. Basically a bridge. I might have a video in the future showing you how I actually do this and how you you can get um, the custom firmware on your router. And this works uh, on a variety of Linksys routers and the reason I said it was 25 bucks to 30 bucks is you can get a uh, WRT54GS or G uh, wireless router on eBay for about 25 and um, pay about five bucks shipping so about thirty dollars shipped to your door <clears throat> you install the custom firmware on it and you're in business and that to me is much better than spending a uh, hundred bucks for xbox's adapter and the speed is actually pretty good it's about the same as if you were going to get it wirelessly anyways so um, yeah thanks for watching uh, hopefully this helps some people you know, you might look into it for yourself. Maybe you have one of those old routers laying around and you want to um, install the custom firmware so you don't need to get a uh, expensive Xbox adapter. And I know this video is kind of late with uh, Xbox's slimmer version out there. I don't know if it has wireless built in or not, but uh, for those who have the original Xbox that doesn't have the adapter, um, this can help you. Anyways, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video, favorite it, comment, and uh, please subscribe. Thanks. Bye.